All right, everybody, so tonight is the second night of Hanukkah, and we thought, what better way to celebrate the Festival of Lights than with some great food? Here to show us how to take your Bubby's latke recipe to the next level <laughs> is lifestyle expert and author of Joy of Kosher, Jamie Geller. Great to Hi, see you. Hi, so great to see you. Pleasure. I love your show, and I love Thank you, Alaska. Thank you. So, I know. Is, you know, we're gonna learn how to make the best latkes on the planet. This is for you, Roy Moore's lawyers. <laughs> Roy Moore's lawyers. <laughs> yeah, you saw what he said, right? Okay, so let's walk through it. Okay. Latkes. Now, so, I sent my yes. son to Jewish preschool, Great. even though we're Catholic, and that is when I fell in love with the latke. Well, it's very easy to fall in love with. It's a classic Jewish Hanukkah holiday food. Can you get it going, the batter, do you mind? Yeah, what do I do? Okay, so you're gonna add eggs, three eggs to your shredded potato. Yeah, how do I shred the potato? You can do it by hand or with the food processor. Oh, there you now, go. Now, by hand, that's how my bubby did it. My family's from Transylvania. She would never, ever take out a food processor. You might get a little skin, a little blood in there. It makes it taste what? better. What? So you know how that goes, guys, right? Okay, so, so eggs. Eggs, a little bit of matzo meal. And can I salt and pepper you as well? Matzo meal? Yes. Okay. You can yeah. use cornmeal if you want to make it gluten-free. Okay. And then you just mix all that together. Something yeah. your mm. former preschooler knows very well. That's right, starting to, to look real. Yes, okay, so now we're going to take a spoon, just Spoonful of sugar, you can take a spoonful of laka batter. Mm -hmm. Good? You yeah, take oh, one, me, I take okay, one? Yeah, sorry. We're doing this together, babe. We are <laughs> in this together. Yeah. We're wearing matching aprons, we're twins today. All right, walk Place me through it. Place it into the hot oil. You put it in yours, okay. I put it in mine. Use the back of your spoon to pat it down. And I use extra virgin olive oil. Okay. Fruity, flavorful, healthful. Can I just go back one step? When I yes. put it in the food processor, what do I press on the food processor? <laughs> on? You <laughs> can do it. You but know then what? like shred? Or yes. What it, okay. No, you use the, a blade that has a shredded disc that like will give you the, you guys know which blade I'm talking about, right? Yeah. Right, I'll look at it. I'll, I'll come over. Okay. Just invite me over for your Hanukkah and holiday right. party. We'll do this together. In the olive oil. Press yes, it down. Yes, in the olive oil. Press it down. Three High. to four minutes aside. Medium. Because okay. you don't want to burn it. Okay. You also don't want to overcrowd your pan. Take your spatula. A long handled spatula. This keeps you nice and safe. Take it under and use one finger, just one finger to guide it. And gently flip over. Okay. Look at that, nice. guys. Round of applause for this baby. Thank you. Nice, intact, and fabulous. We serve that with amped up applesauce. So this mm. is beautiful. We bake it in the oven with some cinnamon and some nutmeg. It's gala apples. You don't have to add any sugar. And it really cuts. Gala are the best. Yeah, the oiliness the of, of the yeah. latkes. Can't stand delicious. Love gala. OK. All right, now what? Phew, I'm glad I picked the right ones <laughs> for this <laughs> segment. OK, so now we're doing next level latkes. We take a classic Jewish deli sandwich, the Reuben, and we make it into a lot. Everything sandwich. here looks delicious. Okay, what do we do? So we are taking the. I'm gonna steal a spoon okay. over here if you don't mind. Okay. We are taking mayonnaise, adding that to the ketchup, and we're making our little version of a Russian dressing. Russian dressing, right? Okay. And our little diced pickles. Okay. Good. So that goes in here. Now we build. You can take corned beef or you can take pastrami, and we're going to do a dollop of our dressing. What is that? That's our pastrami. pastrami nice okay. and peppery and smoky. But corned beef also works amazing here. Do you mind if I use my hands? No, of course okay, not. Okay, good. We're friends now already. <laughs> so layer I'm this I'm the one with up. the hideous illness. You don't like it. Yeah, no. I'll you take know, your germs. You, you don't you're mine. okay. No, okay, fabulous. So I'll give you mine, which I have none. And this goes right here, a little sauerkraut on top. Oh, wow. I love this fun, like, music in the background. It's like it's totally getting me in the mood. And then we've created an amazing slider right here. Just a beautiful toothpick. That looks and this goes right in. Spectacular. Is that ready? Is yes. that amazing, guys? Yes. I want to hear it. Uh, Yay! What's this? Breakfast? Okay. This Breakfast is, by the way, breakfast? this is something you eat with friends, okay? It's not quite date food, but it's like everyone's over for the holidays, so it's good with the family. How is? Oh, my God. Oh, my gosh. That's what we want to hear so when good. we serve food to our family on the holidays. Talk amongst okay. yourselves. So we'll do that. So the family comes over for the holidays. They don't go home. They stay. Right. The next morning, they wake up and they say, what's for breakfast? Right. Leftover latkes. How so? Okay, as if you'll even have any, so you'll have to make double batter. <laughs> but you take your leftover latkes, you throw them on a baking sheet, 400 degrees Fahrenheit. They will crisp up and they'll taste like they just got out of the pan. Yum. We've got a little egg in here, and we're making our version of a latke egg McMuffin. Okay? So we take cheese, mozzarella, Swiss cheddar, whatever you like. Mm -hmm. Once it gets ooey and gooey, which is a professional it culinary like technical term, <laughs> it looks just like this. We take it over here. Oh, that we looks delicious. We place it on a latka. We give it a little bit of salt. And this is also something to eat with the ones you love. Oh, my God. That looks yeah, so good. Yeah, I like that. Oh, yeah. I like that. Oh, yeah. My bubble bath. Oh!
Thank you. That's it. Really. Thank you so much. This is delicious. You will love these. Get these recipes at today.com slash Megan Today. Jamie, thank you. And Hello, Today fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.